Hello guys, so in this video I'm going to run through an unboxing of the Eero 6 and how to set it up with TalkTalk Talk Wi-Fi. So, start off, you have a few information booklets that show you how to set it up, but I'm going to run through all of that on this video. So once you open the box itself, you'll see that it just contains the Eero device. So it has two Ethernet ports on the back and one for the power lead. If you need any more, you could maybe get a switch to add more Ethernet ports if needed. You have the power supply with a three pin plug and then it comes with one Ethernet cable. Also in that black box showroom, it has some extra information in regards to T's and C's really. So first of all, you want to connect the white Ethernet cable to your ONT and then from the ONT you want to connect it into your Eero device and then obviously power the Eero on with the power plug that came. So there's mine all set up and good to go and then we'll move on to the app. So you want to either if you're on iPhone go on to the app store or Android go on to the play store and then hit download and then once it's all downloaded open the app itself. You can either hit allow or not allow for the notifications and then you want to go into log on. You can either use an Amazon account if you have one or you can set up an account if you don't. I just chose to set one up with my email and my number. So that's what I'm running through now. I've just blurred that information obviously just for privacy. So I chose to set it up with my Gmail account. So it brought me through to that and then with once you enter your number it's just going to send you a quick verification code. So once you receive that text, you just want to copy that and paste it into the verification code section and then hit enter. So once you've done all that on this next screen, it just wants to make sure that you have the Eero device, the power cable, the ethernet, and your service is now live. And it asks you to plug this all in, which we've already done. So that shouldn't be an issue. So I'm just skipping through all that. And then I'm just accepting this next thing so that I can find the device. And here it is now searching for the Eero device on the network. So once it finds the Eero device, that's pretty much you all set up and sorted. So next it will just ask what room that the Eero is in, just so it's easy to locate it if that you have multiple Eero devices on your mesh. And then here I just name it something random with a password personal to me. But if you want every device that you have connected to your old hub, I recommend that you name the Wi-Fi name and password and the exact same name and password as your previous hub and then all your devices in your house will just connect automatically. I've just sped this up but that's um, everything good to go with the device and that's it now sorted all connected up. If you have any other devices to connect to the Euro, you can do this through the app. Thanks for watching.